those who love, with those who love, please smile as you say goodbye to the song we must go. Please say a happy cheerio. I think of Almighty Father Ten, so mighty. The white cliffs of Dover till this war is over. This call to arms for the 4th of August 2016 is focused on the Somme and is 102 years since Britain and its empire declared war on Germany. We look at what happened on the 1st of July 1916 and ask if there are any lessons for us today. After a week of heavy artillery bombardment on the Somme using 1,738,000 shells, the British High Command thought the German front trenches and barbed wire had been demolished. At 7.30 a.m. the 1st of July 1916 the British whistle blew. The British PALS battalions and French regiments went over the top on, of their trenches into no man's land. These soldiers may have been gleefully singing as they believed their attack on the German front line would be a walk in the park. But on this day 19,240 soldiers were cut down by German machine guns not a walk in the park. What had gone wrong? The Germans knew the attack on their front line was coming. How? There are apparently many reasons. One suggestion is that the Germans had been eavesdropping and listening to telephone messages between the British High Command and the Allied front line discussing the plans for the Somme. Is there a message for us today? 1 Peter chapter 5 verse 7 to 9 Satan is eavesdropping and listens in to our thoughts. We are encouraged to talk about our worries and concerns with Jesus Christ as he is our personal friend and counsellor. Philippians chapter 4 verse 8 If there is any praise, anything which is of Good report, uplifting and wholesome. Think on these things. First Thessalonians chapter five, verse sixteen to eighteen. Always pray and be positive. If listeners are not familiar with prayer, may I suggest going to a quiet and private place and just talk to Jesus as a personal friend. 
Thank you for watching. And in the words of Reverend Bennett, good people, good people, I implore you, you know in your hearts, this message inspired by the psalm is a surprise, but is good news for us all. For more information on Jesus Christ, contact Kay Stevenson, Galaxy Star at btinternet.com. This broadcast was written by Reverend Bennett. I am Keith Stevenson.